So let's talk about the fountain. The fountain is half DIY and half gutted from my previous one that you might see in my other videos. This is just a glass pie pan that I never use. I've had it since we got married, so like 18 years now. And you can get these pretty inexpensively at like a thrift store or something like that. You could use a rectangular one. It doesn't really matter what shape, I just wanted round, so that's what I grabbed. Um, I, I do like that this one has handles because then the rats can sit on that and it's very difficult to tip over. This piece back here just protects the cord from getting chewed. You can not really see it, but the cord goes through that so that it comes out here, runs along, and then plugs in right there. This is a plastic cup from Walmart. It was 50 cents. I used my hot knife to make holes in it all the way around, and one of the slots in the back is bigger so that the cord can come out. This piece is a fountain head replacement for cat fountains. And then I'm gonna add a video for what's inside. So in this clip, you'll see this little white contraption that attaches to the flower piece. That came with the original fountain and it contains a carbon-based filter and it attaches to the top of the pump that came with the previous fountain. And to make the pieces connect, I used a valve from one of my water bottles and I put it around that little white piece and that created a seal so that the water would pump up into the flower head. Now, most pumps have a small opening at the top. That's what this plastic piece connects to. And you could probably eliminate that whole white chunk by doing just like a piece of PVC pipe and a couple of rubber gaskets. Now the whole reason I have that plastic cup is to cover this white spongy filter piece, which you can get those on Amazon very inexpensively, and you can get the pump on Amazon very inexpensively. So you could really do this entire project pretty cheaply if you wanted to. So yeah, that's how I made it. Do you just love it? Yeah. Mommy! <laughs> you see here, do you want the pebble? It's okay. Did you just have a little battle? <laughs> Yeah, he's getting wet. Look at who I caught being naughty. He's trying to chew his way through it all. Is your pictures in the different time of space? And the evil always just ruins this round too. Wait. And it's beating Goose Goose up. <laughs> Finally, Goose Goose Six Sons isn't stealing a marble. <laughs> and he takes it. Huge. Oh, no, Beaches is losing to the Oasis. Oh, oh. Here comes the tiny marble stealer. Two. No, this is three. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> and the Oasis is winning. Uh, pick up another one? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> this thing, number one, round one. Oh, oh, what is this? No, it doesn't want to show. Oh, oh, no, it got him. It got him, not a cookie. Ah, no, it got him again. Two more times. Oh, good. <laughs> oh. That's Cookie versus the water fountain, round one. Oh no, Goose, oh. this is losing. But Goose, this does not hold back 
and he steals out yet another marble. Where'd it go? He still has it. And, he... and of course, to take another marble. So Come here, you. Give me that. No. He's. I'm so me. I can't, and I'm very long. We must keep the camera at a respectful distance. Ah, uh, that's a good question. Ice cream! Don't follow trouble. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>